Hey everyone and welcome back to Soul Back Sports and I'm so back with another video. And today now with the day under our belt with the Shane Walder and higher, I think it's a good idea to kind of go over some news that are circulating right now. And right now it seems that according to Jay Jones 9 uh, offensive coordinator Shane Waldron is setting up interviews with Kerry Joseph, who was the assistant quarterbacks coach of Seattle, Sanjay Lal, uh, wide receivers coach in Seattle, and Chad Morton, who is the running backs coach in Seattle. Now that with Pete Carroll gone, it's free reign for Shane Waldron. And this is very cool because right after the hire, he's already picking out his staff and he hasn't even done like the media interview yet which is kind of crazy to think about and yeah like it's it's kind of cool to see um it's kind of to go over the people i guess um so Kerry joseph to start off um he enters his second season as an assistant quarterbacks coach after one spending one season as assistant wide receivers and according to this it's uh the seattle seahawks website it says that he has four years of experience and was the offensive assistant and running backs coach in 2020 and he's been on shane waldron's staff for offensive coordinator i think essentially he's bringing the staff from seattle over to chicago and i think that's still a really good idea because you know why change like your current staff because it kind of worked in Seattle and developing um, the running backs, wide receivers, and whatnot. And I'm going to get to the depth chart for the Seattle Seahawks to kind of see what the Chicago Bears are going to be dealing with. And Kerry Joseph seems to be pretty good um, given that he has like a 19-year professional football career. And was passing game coordinator in Southeast Louisiana State. He has a plethora of experience uh, as an assistant QBs coach, and would be pretty good to see. I will actually be intrigued to see what uh, he'll do with uh, whoever we end up at quarterback. Um, Sanjay Law has a uh, 17 years of experience, um, and one thing that stood out to me was that he was a senior offensive assistant in 2020 and was also coached receivers in Dallas back in 2018 and 2019 and had stints in Indianapolis, Buffalo, and the New York Jets and even Oakland when they were still in California. Um, I think that overall this this is also pretty cool to see. I think that he's going to be pretty good. Um, not 100% sure because obviously I don't know these people you know, in depth, but based on the experience I'm seeing, it's kind of cool that Shane Waldron's like, uh, camp is pretty experienced all around. And finally, Chad Morton, um, he was a suspicion, a special teams coach spending five years in five seasons in the same role in the Green Bay Packers. Uh, 2015 he began working as a running backs coach and in running backs room in 2017. And, he worked a lot with, I guess, right now, Charbonnet and Kenneth Walker uh, and on the depth chart. And I guess we can just go to the depth chart right now. So for the wide receivers side, he the wide receiver goes. So it would be Sanjay Lal. And he worked with Tyler Lockett, DK Metcalf, and currently Jackson Smith and Jigba, which is a pretty stacked wide receiver room for a stacked experience. So if the Bears were able to somehow lock up three good wide receivers in our room this will be amazing for us and going forward and then running back depth chart is uh kenneth walker Shaq charbonnet dj uh dallas and kenny mcintosh but yeah so these two are pretty big because hey walker did or had a really good season this season and it boded well with the development that um Shane Waldron and the staff did for him in opening up the running game for him. And it didn't start off great from what I remember in the beginning of the season, but I think they start to pick up speed. And given that Chicago is really good at the run, uh, I think that this is going to be a very good opportunity for him to get some good running backs in the uh, system and be able to develop them as well. So going back to the tweet, I guess, and it's, 
it's crazy to think like already right now like i thought we would be getting these news like later on but it's kind of cool that we got it now and uh i'm really excited to see what happens so yeah this is a little quick video just kind of like highlighting what is happening right now and i'll probably do more the more news comes out and yeah that's it for this video please remember to like and subscribe and comment down below and see what you think about this coaching staff and as always i'll see you guys in the next video